In this lesson, we're going to recognize, sketch, and produce graphs of quadratic functions using a table of results. We begin with the equation y equals x squared plus 3. We square the negative 3 to get 9, and we add 3 to get 12. When x is negative 2, y is 7. When x is negative 1, we square it, and we add 3 to get 4. 0 squared, add 3, is 3. 1 squared is 1, add 3, is 4. 2 squared, add 3 is 7, and 3 squared, add 3 is 12. So now we can plot these coordinate pairs at negative 3 and 12. And when x is negative 2, y is 7. When x is negative 1, y is 4. When x is 0, y is 3. When x is 1, y is 4. And when x is 2, y is 7. And when x is 3, y is 12. And here we've got a smooth parabola with a turning point at 0, 3. Moving on to question B. Again, we can create our table of results. So negative 2 squared minus 1 is 3. 0 squared minus 1 is negative 1. 1 squared minus 1 is 0. And 3 squared minus 1 is 8. We can plot these coordinate pairs at negative 3 and 8, negative 2 and 3, negative 1 and 0, 0, negative 1. When x is 1, y is 0. When x is 2, y is 3. And when x is 3, y is 8. Again, when we draw the graph through the points, it should be a smooth curve passing through the turning point of 0, negative 1. And finally, question C, when x is 0, y is 0, when x is 1, 1 squared add 1 is 2, 2 squared is 4, add 2 is 6, and when x is 3, y is 12. Plotting this point at negative 3 and 6, negative 2 and 2, negative 1 and 0, 0 and 0, 1 and 2, 2 and 6, and 3 and 12. And again, it is a smooth parabola, symmetrical about the turning point, which is between negative 1 and 0 along the x-axis. Thank you for watching. I hope you found that useful. And check out the link in the description for the full lesson.